we're calling this a small articulated motor. You might hear us refer to it as SAL or SAL. You know, in the SAL market, it's kind of a category that's, I'll say, under 50 horsepower that's more geared towards a tool carrier type uh, machine versus you get the compact wheel motors, which say 50 horsepower and above, more of a lift and carry to transport stuff from point A to point B. So this is kind of a tool carrier concept in a smaller compact size. And it's um, like this one's like 25 horsepower. So starting out at that small 25 horsepower to run attachments. Now as a tool carrier concept on here, we're using the Bobcatch, which is similar to our MTL small products, as well as our mid-size uh, compact track loaders or our skid steer loaders. So, you know, this machine can interchange between the small MT attachments as well as we get a little bit bigger, a little bit wider, we can actually move on up to the other size attachments as well to fit the widths of this machine, as well it offers us some opportunity for some new attachment development. This machine here is the L28. We'll have two models in this size class, an L23 and an L28. Both are 25 horsepower. The L23 has a fixed boom, which kind of has a lift height. It's real similar to what the Toolcat is. You know, the low profile boom, as you can see here, as the L28, which is this model here, actually has a telescoping boom. So this one will go up to about eight and a half feet. This machine kind of fits in between a crossover between the small track loaders or mini track loader scene up to the small skid steer loaders or compact uh, track loaders. So it's kind of a machine in between. It fills a little gap that we may be missing. And it also is a nice machine that kind of offers um, some advantages for like a first time customer. You know, it's great. Existing customers will probably find a good need for this but also some brand new customers that are just kind of getting in the business and uh, things like that where they're say, yep, you know what, I want to expand a little bit. Maybe I got a mowing service. I'm in there and this customer wants me to build a deck or a patio in their backyard. You know, they're comfortable with me coming in their yard every week and not tearing it up. So, hey, maybe I'll look at this. Plus it's an extra employee for the machine or for the person as they're starting in the business, you know, instead of trying to rely on help showing up to work every day, with this machine, one person, they can do a lot of work themselves without having to rely on other people to come in and get it done. It's a compact size and it's a low ground disturbance machine. So if you're on turf, whether it's astroturf, grass, established lawns, anything like, anything like that, you can walk, uh, this walk or drive technically on this machine and do turn in corners and everything like that and you're not gonna run up or tear up the ground. It's got a really nice light <laughs> footprint so the customers when they're done or the Contractors, when they're done using this, really don't have to come in and make a whole lot of repairs to the lawn because they can go in and out of that yard all day long without messing it up. Also with a machine this size, it's kind of the sidewalk size. Um, the L23, we can get it down to 39 inches wide and with options uh, about 44 inches, 47 inches, which 47 inches, 48 inches is an ADA compliant sidewalk. So you can actually fit this machine on a sidewalk with a snow blower, angle broom, sweeper, um, has a rear receiver hitch where you can put a drop spreader, things like that. So for the guys that are in the snow removal business in the winter and maybe landscape in the summer, you know, it's a multi-purpose machine. Other things customers like about this, it actually, for the small size, it has a, has a pretty good lifting, heavy lifting capacity. Some of that's it's an articulated loader, but it's a fix. It does not have the oscillation like the larger CWLs usually has an oscillating axle, which on that machine it does give you a little smoother ride over rough terrain. This with a fixed axle actually gives you a little bit more lift capacity. It's lightweight, small machine, transportable. For, so first time getting in the business, if you've got a like a larger lawnmower trailer, you know this machine will fit on there, or a regular pan trailer, or some guys you see in the landscape, they've got the little dump trailers that they pull behind their 1500 to quarter, you know, half ton pickups, this machine will fit on that. Plus they can use a dump box with extra reach with sideboards, dump it in the back to haul the materials away.